then you come to La Flimavada with very little money, and I am talking less than $50, and still have a good time. Welcome back and if you're new here, my name is Amy and I'm a tangerine and we are in Laughlin, Nevada today and I have a challenge for you. We are going to bring out the dreaded B word, budget. We are setting a budget of $50 and we're going to see if we can have a good time in Laughlin, Nevada on that little amount of money. And listen y'all, I am not talking about we're just going to walk around and look at the Colorado River. I want to do three things. I want to eat, I want to gamble, and I want to do some form of entertainment, preferably more than one. So, are you up for the challenge and can we do this? Let's go. We are starting off strong tonight, you all. We have parked the car. This is Trooper, the official mascot of this channel. And the cost for parking trooper at Riverside here is zero dollars. What's so great about Laughlin is the parking everywhere is free here. Unlike Vegas where it's like $25 everywhere you go, it's free in Laughlin. Now you can do valet parking and you will pay for that. Please remember to tip as well. But we are doing the free route. Riverside Casino, how I love thee. Plus you get all this. Look at how pretty the water is. It's just an absolutely beautiful day. When I moved out here, I thought I was just gonna be in Vegas all the time. I just thought I was gonna do all this like incredible fun stuff in Vegas. But I quickly learned that Vegas was not for me for a couple reasons. Uh, safety being one of them. Uh, number two was every time I went, it was like a hundred dollars. Like it's twenty-five dollars just to park, and that is before you even freaking can do anything. Like I was like, park your car for twenty-five, and then you got to pay for like all the entertainment. So I was like spending like a hundred dollars just for me, and if I brought my daughter, double the cost. Like I'm, I I would like to retire someday. So uh, I can't be doing $200 days in Vegas all the time. So I quickly found Laughlin and it has been a godsend for me as far as not overspending. On an upcoming video, we are gonna do the Riverside Boat Tour. So stay tuned for that. And right there is where you would buy the tickets for the River Boat Cruise. Here is a brochure on it. Air conditioning going up. Ready for my lounge. Yeah, that tracks. We have to check out one of my favorite gift shops because window shopping is free. That is really nice. It's a magnetic postcard. This is cute. I love this. Schwig. It's $40 though. That would take up the whole budget right there. Okay, see, this could be dangerous. Yeah. Here's a tip for my shoppy girlies. They always have like really good deals on clothes here and they're really, really nice. I've gotten some really good things here. I mean, look at how adorable this sundress is. It's so pretty. Who wants a hot pickle on a Friday night? We're just going to leave that joke right there because this is a family channel. Okay, bye. Bowling at Riverside is so cheap, you all. I highly recommend it. You can get such a good, it's probably the best deal on the Laughlin Strip here. We are not bowling tonight because I have something very special planned for tonight. 
a really cool, fun, free thing to do is the car show here at Riverside. And if you have one of these right here, it's a player's card. Um, and that the player's card is free, you can get into this for free. Now, if you don't have one of the player card, it's $5 to get in. Here is the price, zero dollars. Y'all, the lady that checked me in, which is the sweetest little thing. Oh, she was so, I wanna like put her in my backpack and take her home with me. The staff here is phenomenal, okay? Phenomenal. All right, so that's kind of kidnapping. Um, and I don't think I would do well in a Nevada prison. Just, just, just a hunch. This is new since I've been here. It's a 2011 Rolls Royce Ghost. Oh, this was Don Laughlin's car. Well, that's really special. It's so beautiful. I've been here multiple times and I usually focus on this marriage trap. But the real star is whoever bought this license plate. You are my people. This car, they move things around. How, how dare they, the audacity of them to move things around when I'm not here. This is a beautiful car. I love that they moved it because you can see it in better detail than it was like down the hallway there. Wow. It's a 1931 Ford Roadster. If you are a biker, they do have a lot of um, like Harley Davidsons and motorcycles in here too. This man right here. If you ever see him when you're here, sweetest man ever. If y'all ever come here, make sure you read these signs. It's like really interesting. Like this, the body of it was built in Kalamazoo, Michigan, and they were assembled in Flint, Michigan, which is where I am from, Michigan. And it was bought by a school teacher and it went into the chicken coop for storage. They cleaned it up out of the chicken coop and got it running again. And the gentleman that works here told me that then when they were restoring this, they found some coins in the car that they have kept with the car. Isn't that cool? I wish I knew where my dad's patch was. I have no idea which one's his. The best view of the Colorado River is from up here. I love coming up here and just sitting and enjoying it because you're in air conditioning and you can just enjoy. This video is on how to do Laughlin on a budget, but of course, like anything else, you can spend some serious cash in Laughlin. Like for instance, the uh, renting the jet skis is going to be expensive. Also, you can stay at a really nice uh, suite. That's going to be expensive. You can go to a really nice steakhouse dinner. So the amount that you spend in Laughlin is really up to your budget and what you want to do. Up here you get a really good view of the pool area. They have a bar out here and then that riverboat where we were earlier. And of course the view of the incredible Aquarius Resort that I adore as well. What a beautiful day. My daughter Sam will be joining us in a little bit for food, of course, <laughs> and uh, the entertainment portion tonight. And then she's going to bail on me again because can you believe this? She doesn't want to spend her Friday nights with her mother. She's got like friends or something. The audacity. I always spent Friday night with my mother. This view up here gives you a really good view of the Laughlin Strip as well. I love this place. I always gotta say hi to the DeLorean. Doc Brown rev up the flux capacitor and transport me back to a time where I did not have adult bills. Thank you. The gentleman that works here also told me that this was, you know, Don Laughlin's car and it was just scattering dust in the garage and they decided, hey, like, let's put it out on display. And I'm so glad they did. It's so pretty. I love this. And we've spent zero dollars. And we got to... Yeah, I didn't know they had more Wonder Women over here. Holy cow. Probably gonna 
regret this due to the heat, but we are gonna walk over to the Aquarius and see if we can get into some trouble over there. The things you overhear in Laughlin Nevada, these people were coming the other way. And the guy was saying that, darn it, he's gonna have a good time because he's gotta report to prison next week. Of course, my favorite free thing to do in Laughlin is just this. Just enjoy the Colorado River. Had to check on my yacht. And my yacht is very cheap to go on. Of course, the dinner cruise is gonna be kind of expensive, but if you just do the scenic tour, I think it came to like $25 per, per person with the taxes included, so that is a really good deal when you're coming here to do the scenic tour. And it was pretty amazing too. I love sitting here by the Edgewater and just watching all the people jet skiing and having a good time. My feet got absolutely annihilated by fire ants. Holy cow, them suckers hurt. Whew. One of my favorite free things to do here in Laughlin is come to Aquarius at night. They always have live entertainment. And you can just sit here and watch the bands. My daughter has called and she wants me to meet her for pizza at Riverside. So we're headed back to Riverside. We are going to get pizza here. We always wanted to try this and never have. So we're going to get it tonight. And the prices aren't that bad. And they also have salads and breadsticks. We got a large cheese pizza and a half order of breadsticks and it came to $25 for both and then $5 tip, so $30, but we're spending, splitting the price, so I'm going to call this a $15 that, we're, that I'm spending. That is the smallest order of breadsticks I've ever seen. <laughs> I thought I was expecting like this big thing. It smells really good though. And there is the cheese pizza and it smells so good. In the gift shop buying a water here for a dollar fifty and you can get cans of Bud, Bud Light for five dollars, my favorite Michelobes. We are at the movie theater because we are gonna see a movie. I bought tickets online. Take a guess what we are going to see. And it was nine dollars and seventy-five cents for a ticket. Thanks. Banna for I don't know what that was, and then it's it was a like two dollar. That's a pot. Oh, it's the cow coming through. No, it's part. No, of you gave it away that we're going to see Twisters. Yeah, I was giving them the hint. You were giving them a hint. Okay, so it was nine seventy five for a ticket, and then two dollar convenience fee per person. And I'm not going to count her costs because she is a fully formed adult, allegedly. We saw this movie already last Friday at the Abbey, and it was fun fantastic i really liked it so we're gonna see it again here and the seats are a little bit better here at riverside than they are at the obby but that's how much i like this movie that like a week later we're already seeing it again and you gotta get popcorn it's a requirement going on the camera now with those shenanigans we are sharing a medium popcorn, and then Sam got, she got the worst drink ever, Dr. Pepper. I know it says Pepsi, but it's a Dr. Pepper, right in the trash. And the medium popcorn and the pop cost $11.75, but Sam paid for it. Thank you, Sam. So we do not have to include it in our total. But if you get this, $11.75, which is a pretty good deal, I think. Here we go, Twisters. Such a good movie. I love it. It got dark. I have walked my daughter out to her car. She is moving on to other things and we are going to soldier on. Let's uh, head down to the Aquarius and do some gambling. I am a huge fan of the original Twister movie so it takes a lot for me to say that Twisters is really really good. I highly recommend it. It is so funny. You wouldn't think it would be funny, but it's funny and it's moving and it's it's all it's all the things. You really gotta go see it if you haven't. Oh my gosh, you all, it's another skunk. 
It's a skunk, you see him? <laughs> Look how beautiful Laughlin looks at night. <sighs> Unbelievably, it's still hotter than H-E double hockey sticks. It honestly doesn't feel like it's cooled down at all. I can see the steam on the windows of the Aquarius. Okay, not steam, but condensation. Look at my yacht, looking all good tonight. And the edge water looks amazing. It's literally the perfect night in Laughlin. Aquarius looks amazing at night. Let's go gamble and I want to go, I want to check out the band too. I love, I'm just going to sit there and enjoy the music for a while. Talk numbers. This is how much we've spent so far tonight. 43.25. And then we're gonna minus the 32.40. And we spent a grand total of $10.85 tonight. Even if we hadn't have won 40, like $43 is what I spent tonight. And I had an amazing time. I mean, how often do you see a seven-year-old man dancing to uh Play that funky music, white boy. Can you put a price on that? I submit to you, we cannot. From the Laughlin Strip, that'll do it for today's video. I think we did good on our challenge. Of course, I didn't get anything to drink and I certainly didn't gamble very much. So obviously, if you're doing those things, you're gonna it's gonna cost you more money. And then if you add in another person, then it costs you more money. But I think we have proven that you can have a fantastic time on very little money in Laughlin. And I will see you all on the next video. I am going to go to every casino resort on the Laughlin Strip and we're going to rank them by five different categories and we're going to see which one comes out as the best. And I will see you there. Thank you all so much for watching and until we meet again my friends, bye! And it's been fun. Let's do Laughlin on the cheap again. And shout out to Kyle. Very nice to meet you. Bye everybody. Push out. People that like Dr. Pepper are like serial killers. And people that like Dr. people that like Diet Coke That's the other way around. Are like the best people on the planet. That's the other way around. No. Uh, here's this truck that I am in love with like you, you ever see like shows where people are like I married my car or whatever 
Wait, am I saying this out loud? Let's just cut that out because that's unhinged. But that's really how much I like this truck. I would marry it. Not really, but really. <laughs>